Welcome to the second discussion on definite integrals. Zero to one x into e to the power x square dx. So how will you integrate if there is no limit x into e to the power x square dx? If you have watched the first two or three videos on integration, you can easily tell me that it requires a substitution because the first check is easy to direct formula. Of course not, there is no formula like this in integration. Second check is check for substitution. Check for substitution. Of course, x squared's differentiation is 2x. So what I'll do is x square I'll take as t 2x dx is dt. So I require a 2 here. I'll divide by a 2. I'll multiply by 1 by 2. So that is equal to 1 by 2. Integration. Let me change the question. 2x dx go as dt e to the power x square is e to the power t dt. Now, wait for a moment because you are doing definite integrals and here is the change. The first change was it was not having any plus c. Second is if there is any substitution then the limits will change because these limits are with respect to x. Zero basically means x smallest value is zero in this and highest value is one. So when x square equals to t, what do you mean by that is t equals to x square and when x was zero, t was zero square which is zero. So when x is zero, t is zero. Now when x is one, t is one square which is one. So when this is one square it is one. So this is zero to one. So this is 1 by 2. Integration of e to the power t dt is e to the power t. 0 to 1. This is 1 by 2. e to the power 1 minus e to the power 0. Which is 1 by 2. e to the power 1 is e. e to the power 0 is 1. As anything to the power 0 is 1. So this is e minus 1 by 2. Let's another more, another problem. 1 by 1 plus x square. <coughs> so obviously there is no direct formula to this and x square is 2x. I mean x square's differentiation is 2x. So this is 2x dx is dt. I can multiply or 2 and I'll divide or 2 and the question will become dt. I'm sorry. Yeah, It will become dt by 1 plus t because this is t integration 1 by 2 I'm not doing anything to the limits what I'm trying to say is this will become log t but this question can be done easily if I'm taking this whole quantity as t 1 by x square I'll take as t 1 is 0 this is 2x so this is 2x dx it's dt if I'll take x square as t it'll become dt by 1 plus t which is log of 1 plus t you can make out by yourself but if I will take 1 plus x square as t so there is a 2 required here there is a 2 so this becomes dt by t integration. So when x is 0, 1 plus 0 square is t, which is 1. When x is 1, this is 1 plus 1 square, which is 2. That's a 1 by 2 here. dt by t is log t. 
I'm sorry. <coughs> yeah, it's 0 to 1. X by X plus X square. 1 plus X square. Okay. So this log T. So this is log of 2 minus log of 1. This is 1 by 2. Log of 2. Log of 1 is 0. This is 1 by 2 log of 2. It's the answer. Now, log of 1 is 0. Some of you might be knowing. And many of you will be telling log of 0 is 0. Join me in the next discussion where I'll be telling you the value of log of 0 is not 0. This is minus infinity. Go with the next video to know how it is. e to the power 1 by x by x square <coughs> should be thorough with differentiation by now. 1 by x you take as t minus 1 by x square dx is dt. So there is a 1 by x square. So what I'm doing is all these quantities are gone. But I require a minus sign, so I'll make a minus here. I'll make a minus so that all these quantities are gone as dt. So this is e to the power t dt. Now 1 by x is t. When this x is 1, e is 1 by 1 is 1. When x is 2, this is 1 by 2. I believe there is a minus sign standing out. So this is minus e to the power t is e to the power t. 1, 2, 1 by 2. This minus e to the power 1 by 2 minus e to the power 1, which is minus of root e minus e. Or in other words, if, yeah, you can leave the answer over here. <coughs> if it is like this, first of all, integration of there is no direct formula to this so the second test is substitution integration of sin x sorry differentiation of sin x is cos x I will suggest you to take the whole quantity as t so this is 0 plus 4 sin x is cos x dx is dt so this is 4 cos x dx is dt but there is a 4 missing here okay now the question becomes dt by t take care of the signs I'm not giving the answers to this I mean this is 0 to pi by 3 so you can make out when this is 0 this guy is 0 3 plus 4 sine 0 is 4 into sine 0 is 0 so this is 3 and this is pi by 6, basically meaning 30 degrees, 180 by 6. Sine 30 is 1 by 2, so 3 plus 4 into 1 by 2, which is coming to be 5. So this is 3 to the power, and 3 to 5, this is a 1 by 4 outside. So this is 1 by 4 log t, 3 to 5. So this is 1 by 4 log 5, minus log 3, which is 1 by 4 log of 5 by 3 owing to the formula log of m minus log of n is log of m by n please join the next video where I'll be taking care of the limits you do not have to bother these all stuff that if there is a substitution the change in limits you can get rid of this in the next video and can make a different integral more comfortable and easier. Thanks for watching.